Yo, what's up? SKD here. Welcome to my channel. Today, we're going to create this. As always, import or trim you clip and let's go to Fusion. First of all, let's disconnect the media in node from the media out. Then let's just add an image plane 3D node connected to the media in. Now add a render 3D and connect it to the media out. As you can see, our clip got smaller and we are seeing the checkerboard. To get rid of this, what we have to do is click on Image Plane 3D Node. Go to Inspector Window. Click on Transform and increase the scale until it fits properly. Add a Merge 3D. Disconnect the Image Plane 3D from Render then connect it to the Merge. Now connect the output of the Merge to Render 3D. Then add a camera and connect it to the Merge. Suddenly you realize that your clip got vanished, it didn't chill. Let me set it up properly so we can see the 3D scene and the final result together. Now some of you may not know how to move in 3D workspace so if you are one of them, then just go watch any tutorial and come back here, others follow. Alright let's add a text node, click on that and add an image plane 3D node then connect the output of it to the merge. Now type the text or the lyrics. We can't see it because it's behind the clip so to bring that forward, click on Image Plane 3D node which is connected to the text and play with the axis and scale it a bit. Now adjust the position of the text by playing with translation values or you can simply use 3D arrows just like me. Click on text node, then go to shading to change the color, I'm using light blue. Now select the text and image plane 3D node, Ctrl plus C to copy and Ctrl plus V to paste. Then connect it to the merge as well. Now type your second text and adjust its position by playing with translation. Don't forget to increase the Z value it's important to give the 3D depth in texts. You can add as many texts as you want by using the same method so I will skip it for now. Here I have added one more text now let's move on to the animation part. Click on camera and go to zero frame. Then go to inspector window and add keyframe to the XYZ translation and also in rotation. I am only adding in Z but it's totally up to you. Let's just play with Z and Y axis a bit. I want to show his face at the zero frame. So let me just move the camera towards the center. Now I will go to the frame 20, you may want to match with the lyrics so change according to that. Now let me move the camera to the first text by playing with XYZ axis. I also want it to rotate a bit so let's change the Z rotation. Nice. Now let's go forward up to 5 frames and add keyframe to the same values. This step is important to hold the movement. Now I will go forward 10 frames and move the camera to the second word by using same method. Let's change X and Z values a bit. I guess I have to play with main clip as well. Let me just change the scale a bit. I also want to change the rotation so let's change the Z value. Alright here we are. I have done the animation for all the texts. Let's see how it looks. Not bad, but we need to make it smoother. So let's go to spline, 
Now click Camera XYZ Offset and select all of them together and click on S on your keyboard. Let's play it. Now it's looking much smoother. I will do the same for rotation as well. Any way you can play with graph and make it more smooth. Now one last thing, click on Render 3D and go to Settings, then click on Motion Blur. You can change the values if you want to, but I will go with default values. Now it's looking nice. Click on Text Node, then add Drop Shadow to make it look better. Play with some values to get a better look, then copy and paste the Drop Shadow node to other text nodes. Now add soft glow and play with gain and glow size. Then do the same step. Well, all set now let's play the clip. Also, if you want to loop the same clip, then go to 10 frames for word and copy and paste the values of frame zero. Now go to edit page and hold alt left click to duplicate the clip. We're all done. Thanks for watching. Do like and share the video if you like my tutorial.